are inside the submersible Titan, which is a carbon fiber and titanium sub that can go to the depths of the Titanic. Hi, my name is Stockton Rush. I'm the CEO and founder of OceanGate. Let's take a look at Titan. So we're coming into the sub. This is the only toilet available on a deep diving submersible. Best seat in the house. You can look out the viewport. We put a privacy screen in, turn up the music, and uh, it's uh, very popular. We have our uh, control screen here, our sonar screen here, and we can put any image we want in the back. We've taken a completely new approach to the sub design, and it's all run with this game controller and these touch screens. So if you want to go forward, you press forward. If you want to go back, you go back, turn left, turn right, go down, go up. And it's Bluetooth, so I can hand it to anybody. And it's meant for a 16-year-old to throw it around, and super durable. We keep a couple of spares on board just in case. This is the second year we've been out to the Titanic. Uh, we went out in uh, five uh, eight-day missions. We did uh, about 10 dives to the wreck site of the Titanic, and we did an extra dive on an undiscovered reef that we found. Completely privately funded um, operation, and we're funded by what we call mission specialists who help support the mission. So they take quite a bit of money to come and join us. Years ago, they t the uh, Russians took tourists out to the, uh, to the Titanic, uh, and it was just sort of a look and see thing. We really are focusing on the science around it. We want to document what the wreck is like now, and also try to predict what it'll be like in the future. It's continuing to decay and it seems to be accelerating. It's being eaten by a bacteria, so it's literally being eaten by the ocean. It's not rusting away. So these things that, that are called rusticles are actually the, the byproduct of a bacteria that eats the iron. And as it does that, these, these uh, decks are collapsing. The promenade deck continues to collapse forward. Uh, we saw some of the railing is starting to, to, to lose its structural strength, which is really a sad thing. That's when it's going to stop looking like the Titanic. The interest in the Titanic is the reason we go there, because people are willing to fund this kind of exploration and science, and that gives a completely different research component that almost nowhere else in the deep ocean can, can you get funding to go back every year for decades and see how coral reefs develop and see how, uh, how metals decay and see how currents change. I mean, that just you, you can't justify that. No government will pay for that. Nobody wants to go back to just some old reef. But people do want to go back to the Titanic, and that's why we go, is because people want to go. Thank you.